There is also a second mechanism that explains the resistance of reverse transcriptase to some of the NRTI drugs, and this is called primer nucleoside unblocking. This animation depicts this second distinct mechanism of resistance to NRTIs. Mutated reverse transcriptase enzymes usually can convert viral RNA into single-stranded DNA. The mutated reverse transcriptase enzyme can still embed the nucleoside reverse transcriptase inhibitor into synthesized viral DNA. Normally, the presence of this inhibitor would cause the termination of the viral DNA chain that is being synthesized. In the case of some resistant enzymes and the nucleoside analog inhibitors of reverse transcription, however, the drug-resistant form of RT can excise the nucleoside analog inhibitor from the synthesized DNA molecule. Hence, the removal of the inhibitor can now allow the process of viral DNA chain elongation to continue. Reverse transcriptase will now complete the transcription of viral RNA into single-stranded DNA.